Hello guys, another red is coming, we'll have the 4th lottery on July 27th, 28th, depending on your time zone. And as always guys, before event starts, I have leaks for you. So let's take a look what we're going to do and what we're going to get during this amazing event. Okay guys, let's go one by one, and the first thing, we have missions, from which you can get duck tickets. Here we can see only 5 missions. But as you can see, we have more than 5. Guys, in all lotteries, we had 6 missions, we had the same missions, so I suppose that the last mission is open chess mission. So let's think that we'll have 6 missions and the last mission will be open chess mission. In the first mission, you need to log in and to complete this mission, you need to log in for 7 days. By the way guys, event will last for 8 days, the last day will be extra day to claim rewards. In the second mission, you need to play in main chapter, supposed to be 40 times. In the third mission, you need to open chests from daily challenges. To complete this mission, you need to open 20 chests. In the next mission, you will need to defeat enemies, supposed to be 1 in 2 millions, but can be 1 in half million. To complete quick battle mission, you need to use quick battles 40 times, but for free to play players, cap is 28 times. And in the last mission, we cannot see here, you need to open chest, supposed to be 300 chests. Ok guys, that's all about missions, now let's check lottery and lottery rewards. As a main reward, you'll be able to get the duck chest, and this time, instead of 100 times, you need to play lottery only 60 times. Here you can see that besides the duck chest, you'll be able to get ducks, duck tickets, gems and 20 shards for war. No S equipments this time? Let's read the description, guys. When you will make vertical, horizontal and diagonal lines, you will get corresponding rewards. For example, if you will make this vertical line, you will get 20 shards for war. And when you will make 3 lines, all these rewards will reset. But it is also said that if you will accumulate a certain amount of bingos, rewards you can get rewards such as S equipment. So as I guess guys, after playing the lottery a certain amount of times, rewards will be changed. Anyway guys, let's give it a little time to see if I'm not thrown. And now, let's check exchange rewards. As a main reward, we have eternal chest, you can get only one chest. The second reward is eternal necklace, As the same situation, you can get only one necklace. 10 hero shards you can buy 5 times, so in total you can get 50 hero shards. The same situation with S supply keys and with pet keys, you can get up to 50 keys. Other rewards are annoying by now, so which of them to get I will talk in my next video when we will have this event. And the last picture I have, I have a picture of sales, unfortunately guys, only of the first 4 purchases. As always guys, watch that stupid ad to get one duck ticket and don't buy this. So guys, that's all what we know by now, as we'll have this event, I will make a normal guide. Subscribe my channel, like this video, do not miss that guide.